A health alert for you and your family. A medical committee with the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is advising against flu mist for this year's flu season. The nasal spray influenza vaccine is popular with kids and also with adults who are uncomfortable with needles. Doctors say, however, it's not as effective as a shot. As Channel 4's Crystal Moyer tells us, the CDC has also made some changes to its flu season recommendations for pregnant women. Suck it up and take the shot. That's what the CDC is trying to get across to families ahead of the upcoming flu season. While some people, mostly children, prefer the flu mist vaccine instead of the needle, studies show it's not as effective. Last year's results show the mist was 46% effective preventing the virus compared to the shot's 65% effectiveness. So the difference is the flu shot contains an inactive form of the influenza virus, while the flu mist contains a combination of live viruses that have been weakened to help stimulate a natural immune response. To put things in perspective, 99 kids died from the flu last year. That's up from 92 the year before. Doctors say a majority of those children were not vaccinated. That's why they say it's important that everyone six months or older get the vaccine. Recent studies have the CDC making changes to his recommendations. It now advises all women who are pregnant or planning to get pregnant get the shot. That's a change from its previous recommendation that pregnant women only get the vaccine after the start of the second trimester. Studies also found the vaccine may not protect everyone. Startling data shows last winter the vaccine had no clear effect on people 65 or older. Oddly enough, older Americans who are more susceptible to the virus get a higher dosage of the vaccine, which is supposed to work better. Experts are now trying to figure out if certain brands of the vaccine are more effective and how long they work. Crystal Moyer, Channel 4, The Local Station.